Some new information tonight on the house fire in New Jersey that killed a little boy and his mother. Police identified the woman killed as 29 year old Amanda Russo. A third victim managed to escape thanks to a good Samaritan who jumped into action. Eyewitness News reporter Naveen Dhaliwal spoke to him and has the story. Majority of the damage to this house appears to be on the second floor. That's where witnesses say they saw the flames shooting out of. Now, one of the witnesses says that he had to stop and help, and it appears his actions saved a life. The calmness of a snowfall interrupted by a raging fire here on Park Avenue. As we drove by the house, I just saw flames shooting out of the, uh, the, the third story or, or attic. Joe Caprio knew he had to help. He jumped out of his car and ran toward the burning house. I'm trying to actually kick the door in, um, even though we're getting no response. And then all of a sudden, I see a hand, like soot covered and charred, and, and you know, reach for the handle, and and like he's like shaking. Stunned, seeing this, Caprio helped the man get out, but and he was like, my 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 grandson and my uh, my daughter are up there. Sadly, the seven year old and his 29 year old mother, Amanda Russo, didn't make it as the fire violently took over the home. Fire crews arrived on scene. Neighbor Pellegrino Sarica watched from across the street. They took the boy, they tried to resuscitate, and then they took the old man out. A heartbreaking sight for many, especially Caprio, whose look on life has now been changed. You just don't know when uh, something, some type of event can happen that'll change your life forever. And um, be grateful for what you have now and you know, thank God for that. No doubt, true words. Now, this man Caprio saved is recovering in the hospital tonight and the cause of this fire under investigation.